Hi everybody. Today I'm going to talk to you a little bit about how to use tags within Evernote. Tags is a way of creating labels or categories for information. In Evernote's case, you create many different notebooks and within each notebook you create notes in those categories. As you can see, I have several notebooks and many notes within each notebook. I even have notebooks in notebooks. As an example, here at the bottom, if you cl click on Web Help Stack, you'll notice that it reveals my other notebooks underneath. And in each notebook, I have additional notes. If you're like me, you break things out into several different categories, and recalling information off the top of your head might not come so easily. That's why I'm choosing to use Evernote to do that for me, and that's how tags help out. If you click down here, in my example, you see I have WordPress notebook. If I double click on that, you'll see here at the very top, there's actually tags already in place. I'm gonna go ahead and erase those tags. I may have tags for several different categories for one note, um, just as a way of recalling that information later. Right now, I might be trying to look up that information by typing in WordPress. Later, I might think of website, and additionally, I might think of tutorials. So I'm actually gonna create all of those tags or those categories for my note. So WordPress, website, and tutorials. Those are my tags that I'm choosing now. Later, if I want, I can use the Evernote search tool and type in the word WordPress, and it's gonna bring up every note that has WordPress in it or has been tagged as WordPress. Another way to search for that information would to be to click on the left-hand column here. It says tags. So go ahead and click on that. And normally, um, there's a few ways you can actually filter that information. Right now, I have it listed as name because I know I'm specifically looking for something WordPress related but you can also click on note count and you see that it rearranges the tags for you and you can see how many notes um, or how many tags you have for each note. But for this, go ahead and click name. It's gonna be easier to find what it is that you're looking for. Now you can go ahead again and type in WordPress and search here, or you can just go to the W section and you can click on WordPress. It's also gonna highlight the other tags for the notes that you have tagged in that one category. If you double click on WordPress, it brings up all the notes with WordPress listed as a tag or in the content. This is just an easy way to, do, to recall information and categorize it. And you may find many different ways to do that. And later, you can even change those tags, add more tags, or simplify it by removing some of those tags. It's totally up to you. So run with it and see what you come up with. 